It's Halloween and we're on the scene. Gun load of candy till we turn green. On Halloween, who eats protein? It's Halloween! Happy Halloween from the BC Anders Critiquer. Sorry, I just love Animaniacs. And today we have a special guest star for our Halloween review. Put your hands together for Thomas Murray of Murray Reactions. Hey man, I'm glad to be here. I thought I'd return the favor of what you did over on my channel. Yeah, a lot of you guys may remember Thomas as the guy who introduced you to my channel with his numerous reactions to my videos and when I made a guest appearance on his channel for his Wonder Woman review. So what are we going to be reviewing together on my channel? In old versus new of Stephen King's It. For those who aren't familiar with it, uh, no pun intended, here's the scoop. It's about the Losers Club, a group of Stranger Thing gang prototypes in the mid-60s slash late 80s who constantly have to deal with bullies, abusive parents, and their quirks. But those all become child's play when the town is invaded by a horrifying demon that embodies one's deepest fears, but usually takes the form of a creepy clown named Pennywise who bears a striking resemblance to Tim Curry and Bill Skarsgård. Sooner or later, kids all over town started to disappear here, starting with Bill's younger brother, Georgie. With all the kids disappearing and turning up dead and with no sure pooper, Bill and his friends, locally known as the Losers Club, decided to nut up and take on Pennywise himself. And they succeeded. Well, for 30 years at least, but when Pennywise makes his ghastly return, the club, except for Stan who chose the easy way out, ugh. Return to town to stop him once and for all. In November 1990, ABC brought the story of Pennywise and the Losers Club to the world of mass media with the It miniseries where it went on to become one of the better, if not the best, Stephen King adaptation of all time. But then again, Tim Curry was Pennywise, so that was to be expected. For 27 years, things went dormant for the killer clown. But then in the late 2010s, Hollywood decided it was time to bring the Red Nose Menace to the silver screen by releasing two movies based on the novel, each one covering the different ages of the Losers Club. Probably for the sake of simplicity. But of course, which adaptation leaves the greater impact? Which one was not only scarier, but also just adapted King's novel for the screen better? So beware of the clowns and keep away from the sewers of Day or Main, because it's time to put these two killer clowns to the test. This is Old vs. New, Stephen King's It. Wow. 